Yo guys, welcome back to Danganronpa. We haven't played this in about four weeks. So, this is the sixth episode. And, yeah, let's, let's just jump into this. You already know the deal. Last time, uh, can't really remember what happened, to be honest. But I still have my suspicions of, of Biakia being the mastermind, because, like, he is sus right now. Okay, so can we check the dialogue or something? Because I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Transcript. Yeah, that's it. Right. There's still plenty of... Oh! Oh yeah, no. Um, yeah, no, it's talking to Toko. And the free time thing. Just trying to give myself some flashbacks because I haven't actually watched my episode. Because, yeah. Oh, yeah, this is where, um, Biokia was. So, and he's saying, I oh, like, fuck you and stuff, I'm going alone. Can I do free time with Biokia, actually? Hold up. Not that I want to, because I want to talk to good characters. Not possible ones who could be setting us up for death. So, Hiro Mondo. Why are they always together? Hiro and Mondo are always together. Okay, so. Usually everyone's around here, so I don't think I can actually... Okay, there we go, we're back, and, uh, yeah. So why are these two actually always together, though? Because that's a bit weird. Because Chihiro's one of my favourites, because, like, she's fucking adorable. Mondo, he's alright. is really loud so I'm gonna turn that down. There we go, it shouldn't be as loud anymore. But Jesus, alright, so who do we actually have? So Kyoko, Toko, Ifumi, Taka, Celeste, Asahina and Sakura. It is Sakura, right? I, I hope I'm saying that right. Because I remember I kept on saying it for, I kept on saying that for like Sayaka, and I only realised that halfway through. So I really hope I'm saying that right now. Actually, I'm gonna go check. Sayaka, Sa Sakura, yeah. Okay, so Sakura. Then I, I'm guessing that's how you say it. Like. Properly. Remember, I'm new to like anime and that, so like, please, if you're watching this, don't diss me in the comments if I get anything wrong. Because I'm new to this kind of shit, but I've only started watching like. I've only really watched the entirety of My Hero, a bit of Dragon Ball, like two episodes of Assassination Classroom, and that's basically it. Also played Dragon Ball, My Hero, yeah, but that, that, that's beside the point because it's not actually like anime, I guess. Actually, is it? Eh. Anyway, let's just go talk to like Toko again, I guess, because I can't really think of anyone else to talk to. Actually, do I? Yeah, fuck it, Toko, why not? Oh, I can't teleport. Oh, actually, do we do Celeste? Oh, well, we've done Toko about 50 times, so let's do Celeste. What? Where, where? Where is Celeste? Oh. 
or Celestia or whatever. Where, where the fuck? Where? Can't find her, so we're going back to Toko. Press the doorbell. Ding dong. <laughs> Did you come here to anyway. yell at me? My whole life is one unpre unpleasant experience after another time to tell me we're coming back to the stuttering Hayden. You know better than this. Sure. Yeah, why not? I was perfectly happy spending time on my sweat. Oh, okay, <laughs> then I'll just go. But I guess if you're so desperate for attention, I guess I can hang out for a bit. I spent some time with a cold and distant oh, Well, that was fun. Yes. How do I give presents? Because I haven't actually got ever anything. And the thing that I tried to give last time, it just said fucking no, basically. Like, if I try to give her this. Sorry, but we can't know. Yeah. Key item. Yeah, I'm sure. I thought Toko totally hated me. But it's not like she's going out of her way to avoid me. Still, we're not talking either. Hey, Toko, your what? You have a question. You have a question for your classmate. Is she happy? Oh, she looks happy. So you kind of asked me before, but what do you like to do in your spare time? <laughs> I just write. I'm serialized, so I'm always really busy. And when I'm not writing, I'm studying. I'm not an idiot like you. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, no, she's... That minute I had to go and open my big mouth again. You must hate me for sure now, right? No, didn't really bother me. But I can't believe you actually write novels and that people all over the world read them. So how do you get your ideas for what you write? Is it like real life experience or... Are you stupid? What? I told you, didn't I? I, I write romance novels. How could I use my real life experience for that? It's all from my imagination. It's just delusions. Delusions that you thought, oh, oh no. You can't let... Ah. I see what's happening here. Eh? Oh, I didn't say anything. It's okay, I'm, I'm used for people making fun of me, but someday I'll show them I'll get pretty one day and so What? That's all done ahead of it. Oh. So, are we in a bad relationship with Togo or what then? Because, like, she doesn't seem very happy with us. And that makes me want to go back to talk to her. But if it's going to make her more pissed off, then I don't want to. It sucks. Went to breakfast meeting, same as always, but... Oh, God. Oh, everyone's already here. Yeah, most likely because Biaki is not here. I looked around, Toko's not here. Biakia and Toko stormed off yesterday and it wasn't too surprising that they hadn't come today. Did I cause that? Oh no, I really hope I didn't. Even the table even the table looks bigger somehow. I assume that it's because three people are dead and two are stay oh, oh oh yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. But I know Biakia's whatever, but shouldn't we go check on Togo? Serious? I don't know, she's super annoying. Like, <laughs> shut up, man. How can you be so cold? You're like a piece of rock you candy. Well, no rock... Oh, okay. Shit. So... Okay, now we're back on the real stuff. Anyway, Biakia's the real pro problem. Yeah, he's like the thing... He's the man behind all this stuff. I'm telling you. Like, it's gonna come to a stage where someone's gonna find out and be like, Biakia's doing something which is controlling the school or something. I'm telling you now. I'm that confident. If you don't keep an eye on him, he might really kill someone. You can see it in his <laughs> eyes. We've got no choice. Get some rope. We're gonna have to keep him bound, bound and gagged. I think that's going a little too overboard. No, it's not. 
It's just like when we were kids and some someone would go crazy at sports day. What? What the fuck are you talking about? You <laughs> are you gonna use the rope to do tug of war or something, you idiot? Yo! I'm not an idiot. You're an idiot. Oh, Damn you! So we're talking about fucking this man who's possibly behind this whole thing, and now uh, we're going to idiot. And you've made your hero sad. Well done, Mondo and Taka. What's wrong with your hero? You don't look Aww. so great. Oh, I'm just going for a little self love it. After what Biakia said to me yesterday, I just got so nervous. I looked up, I couldn't say anything. Mondo ended up having to help me out. Oh, that's why! He said, also. Aww. Mondo, you dickhead. Aww. As I see, Mondo make you depressed. What? Well, how's it my hey, fault? I wasn't trying to be mean, besides girls are just naturally weak anyway, right? Ah, uh, someone in this room would say otherwise. Are you crying? It's because you're screaming like a lunatic. Hey, come on! Hey, come on, don't cry, it's my fault. Okay, I won't yell at you anymore. Really, I'm not sure I can believe that. Just what? shut up. I got it, I'll what? make you a promise as a man. Promise as a man? Yeah, that's right. Maybe I mentioned this before, but ever since I was a kid, there was one thing my brother told me over and over again. He said that no matter what, a real man always keeps his promises, and that's what he left me. Uh, left yeah. you? Oh yeah, my brother's dead. Oh right. That's see. true. Anyway, I don't want to talk about it. Don't you? Wa don't want to make all you guys cry. Yo. Anyway, so you can trust me when I make that promise, so you don't gotta cry anymore. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Mondo. Uh, sure. But but I still don't like how I am right now. I have to get strong. Oh, okay. If I am so weak, anything can make me cry. That's not good. Still, don't tr stress out too much about having to get stronger. Um. No, I want to get stronger. Maybe I should w start working <laughs> out. In that case, I'd help you. Be happy to help you out at any time. <laughs> In this, what? Just a second. Shut up, you. How would she, <laughs> for fuck's sake? Like, yeah, she's small bean, but like, how? Yeah. Oh, wait, I see. Never mind. Oh, finally cracked a smile, huh? Yeah. Thank you. Everyone, thank you. Looks like your hero's gotten some life back. Yeah, man, if we keep helping each other, okay. Yeah, no, no. Just, just, no. Just, just, no, 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 no. It's the other two, never showed up to breakfast. What can I do? Okay. Okay, so what should I do today? Free time. <sighs> Matt, who's a. Uh... Oh, Toko's back! Okay, going to talk to Toko because I want to see what she was actually doing with Biakia. If she was with Biakia. Should I? I feel like she's with Biakia on something. Fuck it. <laughs> Leave me alone, you don't have to pay attention to me. Should I hang out with her? Yes. <laughs> Do whatever you want. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Why well, is it the same look every time? Oh, so nothing today then. So Makoto is not going to ask why suspiciously Biakia and Toko were missing at the same time. Oh wait, yeah, no, I can skip it, can't I? Yeah, let's just skip. I thought I actually had to go talk with someone, but... Alright. They're going to go get something to eat and I feel like something's going to happen. So I'm recording this, so there's going to be a dead body, or an argument, or something. I just wanted to get something to eat, and now I'm about to get roped into something like this. Actually, no, I guess I'm already roped in. Uh-oh. Listen to me! And my photo, perfect timing. <laughs> What's going hey, on? Damn it. I have a favour to ask. A favour, I have a... Yeah, oh no. Hey, damn it! Come on, Makoto, you've got to be our witness. Witness? Witness to what? what? This guy's been talking shit about me since day one, call me a coward and shit like that. You're corrupt! You are a coward, that's why you turn violence to solve Yo! your problems. That's why you can't do what society thinks of you while you walked around dressed like huh? that. The fuck are you saying? You don't know shit. You hear me? 
you've already lost it to yourself, but you're in such you're such a coward you don't even realise it. Damn so you! What you're saying you're not a coward. You think you're tougher Count than me? Oh, for fuck's sake! You I know I am. Fight. Right, let's throw down. Prove that you, you thought what me? I don't. I accept what? your challenge. So that's what happened in the photo. You're gonna be eyewitness. You're gonna throw down. You're not gonna like start punch each other, are you? There's a bathhouse on the first floor of the dorm room, right? Is there? Is there? Sorry, I haven't played this game in like four weeks, almost a month. So. I see. A simple endurance contest, it. is it? We're gonna see who can stay Piece in the sword of the longest. Goddamn straight. Okay, so no one's gonna die. Thank fuck. You guys really gonna Stop go through with this? Shit, yeah. yeah. He'll be done in a matter of minutes. Anyway, people like him are always are uh, without expectation you or thought. Bring it on. Let's make things interesting. We wouldn't wanna win without a challenge, right? Interesting. You son of a bitch. We're gonna battle with all of our clothes on. Ridiculous. That's idiotic, suicidal. Fight. What are you afraid? Mm -hmm. You're going to regret Stop this. Fucking around. Shut up and let's do this. I like it how they're not having like a proper hey, fight. Mondo. And they're just like this. I thought that was a fucking axe going through Mondo's head then. What asshole. You can take off your uniform, you know? Go ahead. I won't judge. And you can shut the fuck up and mind your own business. I mean, look at you. Your face is all red. What are you, one of those goddamn hot spring monkeys? What? It just so happens, I was born with a red face. You don't have to. Act all big, man. Act, you say? <laughs> I'm still plenty good to go. I'm so good. I could eat a steaming hot bowl of soup right now. Makarto, I gotta get him a steaming hot bowl of soup. Are they okay? I tried to push my concern. Can we just get some. It's been an hour. Don't you think it's about time you gave up? What about you? You can't even hardly talk. Dumbass. Say whatever you want. I'm still totally good to go. In fact, I'm starting to feel uh, kind of cold. That's probably not good. Hey, uh, guys, I know you both want to prove how big of a badass as you are, but don't you think you've done enough? I can't win. Oh, fuck. I I'm surprised we can't get food. <coughs> hey, didn't you hear that? It's night time. How about we call it a tie? In a true competition, there's no such thing as a tie. You win? Or you lose. That's the only thing that matters. Listen to you, you son of a bitch. Then bring it on. I'll, I'll push you right up to the gates of hell. Okay, okay. this uh, isn't good, guys. Uh. Yeah, you hear him. Better crawl on your back to your room. I'll let you know how how it went in the morning. Then you can start spreading my legend. <laughs> Come tomorrow morning, you'll fall down in front of me, down your, on your knees, and I'll show you where to do it. Big talk for someone whose face is about to explode. Right back at you. Okay, well, good night then. Fucking hell, everyone's going insane. Okay, so everyone's here. What are you talking about, bro? What are you talking about, bro? What the? Yo. Hey, Makoto. Thank you so much for acting as our wit witness yesterday. Are they friends now? <sighs> They've been like this all morning. They were all buddy buddy as soon as they walked in. It feels what? gross. Feels gross. Hell no. It feels great more like. <gasps> this almost feels like sexual harassment somehow. <laughs> forget, uh, forget her, bro. A girl like her just doesn't get our manly bond. Friendship between men is stronger than blood. A woman could never Ain't understand. Ain't that right? What you just said, bro. That was a coolest shit. Without a doubt. Can I just skip this, please? I'm just Piece gonna read it in my head because I don't want to miss something if it's important. I see. Friendship. Uh... Okay, so it wasn't important at all. Is it free time again? So what should I do today? Oh, okay. Who could that be? Oh, Toko! 
Hey, yeah? Topo, what's the matter? What's your problem? Why are you so surprised? Am I really that annoying? <laughs> well, I already know I'm annoying. I came here knowing that, so that makes it okay. No, you're not annoying. I just wondered what was going on. <laughs> I have a favour to ask. I want you to go somewhere with me. And where is it you want to go? What? Well, the library. You looking for a book or something? Why didn't you decide to be Agia? He spent all of his time in the library anyway. <laughs> Did I say something wrong? <laughs> You're not a blubbermouth, right? So this has to be a secret. I honestly have no idea what you're talking about, but if you want me to be quiet, I'll be quiet. <laughs> then let's go to the library. Okay, I got it, the library. Jeez, why so pushy? <sighs> quiet. Be quiet when you go in. Don't let him see you. She actually was starting to get annoying, but I did what she said and gently crept into the library. Yeah? Answers for okay. He's here. Oh, he's really here. Okay, Makoto, go talk to him. What? Stop messing around. Yeah, 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 yeah,
like I just said, she just seems nice and stuff, but then a bit misunderstood, and then she goes a bit crazy, but like, fucking Biarchio's just a massive dickhead, so that is scary. Let's see what she says. Did you come here to yell at- Anyway! Oh, she already said this earlier. Spend some time with Toko. I was perfectly happy to spend time by myself, but if you're so desperate for attention, okay. Oh, so it's the same thing over and over again now. No, because I can't. Right. Let's go spend some time with someone else. Oh. Okay. Oh, we need to gather in a gym. I thought that was just a nighttime thing. But Monokuma says we have to go in the gym. Who's this up here? Mondo and. and Kyoko, so. Actually, wait, no, I thought that was like talking. No, I, oh no, 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 this isn't. That's not the right way. It's down here. I don't have a good feeling about this either. I have a bad feeling about this. But I've had to gym. Isn't that the gym? Right. <clears throat> Asking us to gather it all of a sudden, what, like, a time like this, what could he well. possibly want? Indeed, he might await us this time. <laughs> he keeps things interesting, that's for certain. Um. How is that funny? Can't you smile like a normal person once in a while? Like how, okay. What the heck? There's something totally messed up with you if you can laugh at a time like <laughs> this. Which one of us is actually messed up, hmm? Huh? What is that supposed to be in? Nothing in particular, just admiring, that's all. I don't want to kill anyone, but I also don't want to stay here living in a... Okay, huh. okay. He's saying the same thing over and over again. I was just admiring how you could live like that and still keep your sanity. What okay, wait, this? no, he's not fucking... <laughs> Of the frames. That reminds me, remember how you kept talking about the police? How did that sound? Well, yeah, so he's basically just huh? saying the same thing. Certainly. That's strange, that is true. There's no way that the police wouldn't know about it. We're right in the mi middle of a major urban area. The police suck. Mm. On one contrary, the mastermind may just be that powerful to take control even of the police. Could it be? Oh, this might not be related, but. <laughs> Then don't say it. Hmm. No, nope, I'm gonna it's say not it. Like some occult it's mystery. about last night. I went in the main hall, just staring off into step into space, and then all of a sudden I heard it. Huh? You heard what? Hmm. A sound that I didn't really know what <sighs> was. What kind of sound? Hmm. Well, like I said, I don't really know, but I had to describe could it. It, be... it was like a construction site, I guess. For serious. I mean, I could just be making it up. I only heard it. Barely heard a thing. <laughs> you definitely made it up, mate. Must have just been the sound of the ocean in that head of yours. Say what, what you're talking about, Doko. Who in the world? Okay, now I know. Yep. The big boy's back. <sighs> He's arrived. <laughs> well, here I hope wasn't the sound of construction, but it could have been an explosion. <laughs> Or maybe a machine gun. That kind of, that kind of sound like a construction in a way. What are you talking about? <laughs> Beyond this point, my mouth is zipped. And my lips are sealed. I'm fully puckered. It's a secret little yeah. secret. It's a secret little secret. <laughs> Fine. Then let's move on to what you can tell us. Why did you call us here? You didn't. You don't beat around the old bush, do you? Ready for me to get to the point, huh? But before that, you mind if I vent a little? I'm on low of energy these days. My stitching's even losing a little shine and luster. I'm thinking it's probably because of this ho hum, boring old day of everyday life. I'm looking for someone with a little more s a s st stimulation, something right I can. Yep. Listen, can I just be frank? The next black and hasn't shot black and hasn't shown up yet and I'm starting to get hey, bored. Um, so I've decided to come up with a new way to motivate you. Wait, wait. It's another set of videos or something. Are you gonna show us something so demented thing some demented thing to try and get us all to drive to yes. murder? Drive you to murder oh, okay. You hear me? Let's just say it. I don't know what you're gonna you've got planned but we're not gonna Yeah, last time someone said that someone Go killed. Ahead. Okay. Mm. 
Hmm, that's very big talks to you, but okay. Without permission at the beginning. This time it's embarrassing memories and secrets. As long as you're alive, it's a given that there's things you don't want other people to know about you. So they let a little investigation for of height of my own, and I dug up some of your darkest secrets. And those Can embarrassing memories and secrets are all contained in the envelopes I have right here. I'm going to hand them out now. So take a second to take a peek. I put the statue of the envelope with my name written on it. I obviously pulled it out to see what's and my entire body went rigged. I tried to wet the bed until he was in fifth grade. <laughs> what? Oh. How? Yeah. How did you find out about this? Everyone started talking at once. <laughs> you have 24 hours. If someone doesn't become blackened by Extreme. then, all the deepest, darkest, most embarrassingest secrets will be exposed to the world. Maybe I'll roll by a crowded interception in a van strapped with loudspeakers and spill the beans. Yeah. Okay, I wouldn't... Oh, wait, I shouldn't read that. Wouldn't that be so embarrassing? So that's what you meant by motivate. <laughs> Say that I pissed the bed. <laughs> it's a fucking... Isn't that bad to some other people's stuff? Like someone could have said, oh, I commit murders or something. It's definitely something I'd rather people not know, but we'll never kill up those or something like that. Count so what did you say? It. He's right, your plan is doing fair. And I was going to murder someone for this, this kind of thing. Kind of is it because for better or for the worse, your memory is still a way to connect to the outside world? I have stuff I don't want anyone to... Okay. <laughs> you really start... Okay. What can you do in the next 24 hours? Oh, I suppose all your three secrets. Okay. So, um. I didn't ex know what to expect first, but at first, but maybe we dodge a bullet on um, this one. I mean, yeah, having those secrets revealed is going to be totally embarrassing, but then that's seriously not enough to give someone a reason to, to kill, me. right? Good news, everyone. I have a brilliant idea. Me? Someone's going to have. Someone's going to have, like, a secret, like. Oh, um, I killed. 20 people in one day or something without a doubt and i'm now a known psychopath if we do that and okay wait yeah quiet down and listen okay so my embarrassing thing is i don't want to hear your stupid story <laughs> besides i don't want to talk about it i don't care what anyone says i don't want to talk about my arm as for me neither do i no not because it's unpleasant but because it's impossible oh? Well, if it's human nature to hit, want to hear it, then I say it's impossible. Come on, it'll be good for you. Absolutely come not. Come on, come It's okay, on. just a little bit. Come Honestly. on. As I said. Here we go. Hey. I said I don't want to talk about you, the human bag of lard. Say what? I agree with them. There's no need to discuss it. What do you think, Chihiro? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't really want to talk about it right now. But. But I also don't want to leave things the way they are, so maybe I'll talk about it later. After I try my best to become stronger than I can tell so, everyone. Um, okay. That's true. If everyone's that against it, even my bros have managed to address it, even I echo to say no. Well, that's okay then. Either way, it's just a few secrets. I'm sure nobody's about to kill it. Someone's going to kill over it. <clears throat> Okay, I'll stop with a secret me? talk, but each of us has 24 hours to get ready. Having our secrets of fuck exposed isn't going to be fun, but it's not like we're going to die because of it. So, you know, don't do anything hasty. Okay, yeah, exactly. Just stop saying it over and over again. Right, now it's night time. Okay, so Monokuma comes out of nowhere and wakes us up. <laughs> nice reaction. I'm glad to see you didn't disappoint. B what are you doing yeah. here? I want to spice things off. So instead of scoring out to it, I wanted to wake you up in person. What the hell for? Because it's fun. As long as, as long as I'm here, I figured I'd let you hear it out my damn mouth. Are you sure you should be acting this laid back? I mean, even though something happened to one of your buddy buddy classmates, what? Your face is so blue like someone is on the verge of death. What happened? What are you talking about? That's for me to know and you to find out. Good luck. 
something happened to someone. Is it? Was it? No, it can't be. There's no way someone would. But what if it? Okay, shut up. The dining hall. What happened? What happened? What happened? What ah. happened? Oh, Makoto, uh, uh, are you okay? Hey. Did Monokuma talk to you too? Hiro, Hina, Sakura, and Biakia. You're the only ones here. Where's everyone hmm. else? Either they're already off trying to verify what Monokuma said, or they've fallen victim to something that Monokuma mentioned. That something. Perhaps. It can't be. Has it happened again? Murder. I was hearing what Monica had to say, the possibility forced its way into my mind. I took everything I had to drive that thought away. Uh, um, so if something really did happen, does that mean it, it, something did offer what happened yesterday? Huh? Not. Hmm. This whole memory is not just sure about that. Clearly someone felt it was more important than that. <laughs> to judge someone else's values based on your own outlook. Do you know how dangerous that is? Why didn't you say any something like yesterday? Did you already forget this isn't a co-op game, it's every man for himself. What good does it do for me to go out my way to help Just you? The worst. Stop saying that already. Um, There's something wrong with him, so, so serious. Did he get brainwashed wait. or something? That's not important. What matters right now is we find out what happened. That's fine. That's right. Let's split up and begin looking. This game's a foot. Okay, so... Um... I think I found something here. The door's open, but the aren't they supposed to be locked? For this investigation, I have unlocked the doors. Please look around to your heart's content. Oh, okay, then that explains it. It's investigation, just as I thought. I but you're Judging from what you said, there's no doubt I might have really could have taken place. Come on, in the locker rooms. They're suspicious, very suspicious indeed. Wouldn't you agree? Very <laughs> suspicious. No one's... It seems nobody searched the locker rooms. Let's start with the girls' locker room. Who is muttering as if he is only talking to himself, waiting for a reply. He presses his hand against the locker room door. And the door slung open without a sound. In that moment of time, seemed to freeze. What's going on? What? Oh, for fuck's sake! Are you kidding? Again? Why does it have to be Chihiro? Out of everyone! Why well, couldn't it have been like Hifumi or something? Why would someone kill over a fucking secret? Are you joking? Are you actually joking right now? No, this is fake or something. <laughs> no, it, it's fake. She's she's just fake in it. It urged out on me like water. Okay, okay. Be okay on the other hand. Very strange. But it's unusual, don't you think? He was almost okay. Sorry. I see. Look, Shihiro's corpse has been suspended somehow. There's something's been written on the wall in blood. Blood blast. Hmm. Right. So, we're going to end this here because I'm going to run out of time if I haven't already. So, yeah, I'm just going to say it now. Peace.